In this video, we're going to be looking at how we can rotate objects inside Blender, as well as revisiting the move and the scale commands whilst we make a snowman. The first thing we should do when opening Blender is to go to the top right hand corner and select Viewport Shading. Next, we need to get rid of this cube and we're going to start to add the components of a snowman. So hit X, delete the cube, go to Add, go to Mesh, and we have a choice of different shapes. We're going to be using the UV sphere. Remember, because it's a 3D modeling environment, if we use a circle, which is a 2D shape, you wouldn't be able to see it. So click on UV sphere, and that's going to be the body of our snowman. We're going to go to Add, Mesh, UV sphere again, and we actually have another sphere, but it's on top of the other sphere. So if we click on one of them, go to the move command on the left hand side and drag the blue arrow, we can see that we have one sphere on top of another sphere. If we rotate round, we have something which is starting to resemble a snowman, but isn't a very good one because the head and the body are the same size. If I collect, so if I select the bottom part, I can then press the S key to scale and make that bigger. So I now have a much bigger body to my snowman with a much um, relatively smaller head. Looking good so far. What I now need to do is go and add a nose to my snowman. So if I go to add mesh, I'm going to add a cone to be the nose, a little bit like a carrot. And that's inside the sphere at the bottom, so I need to move that right to the top there. Now we have a problem with our nose because our nose is the wrong way round. So we need to actually rotate this nose. And the rotate command is the circle arrow command with the diamond in the middle. If I click on that, I get these little grab bars. So if I grab the red bar, it only rotates along that axis. And of course, the blue bar would rotate along that axis and the green bar and so on. So I'm going to put my nose facing this way and I need to move it to the front of the snowman. Let's go see. So far, so good. It's in the right location and it's rota rotated in the right way, but the problem we have here is the nose is far too big. So again, we need to scale the nose by pressing S, shrinking it down, and then I have a nose on the front of my snowman. Next, I need to go and add a hat to the snowman. So I'm gonna to go to Add, Mesh, Cylinder. And this adds a very big hat to the top of my snowman. I want to shrink it down again, so I press S to size it. And then what I'm gonna do is gonna move it on top of the head and just rotate it very slightly. So back to the rotate command over here and rotate it at a slight angle along the, uh, the red axis, back to move, put it there. And now I have in front of me a snowman with a little hat on. I might want to squish the hat down slightly as well, um, but I'll leave that to you.